All right, hi everyone. It's a. Uh, it's what is it? It's like the 22nd of December, and it's about one o'clock Mountain Time. I'm back over here on the spot. I'm gonna try yet again. Uh, I got me a few dozen. I got a dozen worms with me. I'm gonna try up a tie up a rig, kind of like a Carolina rig. I'll show y'all it when I get it tied up. And I also got the fly rod. And we'll see if I can get anything. So this is the rig. I, I don't know if you can see or not, but I have oh probably about a quarter ounce bullet weight, and then I got a swivel. All I had was three weights, so that's what I'm using. And then off of that, I got probably two and a half feet of line down to a hook, I don't know, maybe size six or so, and a piece of worm on it. Kind of, I believe, on the lines of a Carolina rig is what we call it in the States. If y'all got a similar rig, let me know. I'll stare at the see so y'all look at the rod tip on that one. Let's see what y'all doing here. Taking y'all all over the place. There we go. Keep an eye on the rod tip for me. All right, folks, I'm on. Got myself a little sucker here. Had to go unconventional. Get them landed and I'll show it to you. Oh, hopefully I didn't smudge the lens too much. Let me check that first. All right, here he is, a little common sucker. Pretty bad, I had to put a piece of worm on a little buzzer nymph and float it under an indicator on my fly rod just to get this little guy. That's how stubborn they're being today. I'm gonna throw him back though. Oop. Oop. He's all right. Oh yeah, that's that's how stubborn they're being today. I've been out here for almost an hour and a half at least. 
and that's the first fish I've gotten and as I said I had to put a piece of worm on a little bitty fly and float it underneath a, a yarn indicator to get it so I'm gonna see I'm gonna pull in this line on my spinning rod and see if anything's on that see there's a spinning rod see if anything's on that I don't think so I haven't seen it move or anything for the entire time it's been out here I know it's on it let's see if my worm's still on it yeah it looks like the worm's still on it at least part of it seems like something's been nibbling on it maybe got itself wrapped up pretty good so it's got the hook all there we go the hook wasn't exposed all that well might be half the reason why there go ahead and cast them back out see what we can get if we can get anything on this it'd be surprising See if that does anything.
pretty much how it's going. Make a couple casts and don't get nothing. cast down that way because I got trees right behind me and I gotta make a half decent cast because the fish are about halfway out there. So Alright folks, we got another one on finally. It's taken a while. Nothing special, it's just a sucker. Oddly enough, I haven't had any luck on my big old worm on my conventional. All I've been I've just been having luck. A little bit of luck I've been having it's just been on my fly rod. This time, just on a little bitty uh, zebra midge. Let me get them landed and I'll show you. Sorry. There he is. Another little, little common sucker. A little common sucker, he's not very big. I'm gonna get him back. Dang, what the fuck is Let me go show you something if you can see it. I'm probably gonna have to pull him out of there with a stick of some kind. Uh, you see that? And when I put him back in, he must he got his head buried in the weeds. And he's just staying there. So I'm gonna have to get a stick and try to push him out of there. Yeah, that's the second one that I've caught in about oh maybe two and a half hours. It was on a little bitty uh it was on a little bitty um zebra midge. It was like a size 16 or something. Let me see. All right, folks. That's going to be it for today. Managed to get two suckers, both of them on the fly rod. 
oddly enough one of them one of them I ended up cheating and put a piece of worm on a nymph and floated that under an indicator and then the other one it just took a regular old zebra midge no nothing like that and then oddly enough I had a whole worm on my uh, spinning gear and didn't get if I had any bites I didn't notice them so well maybe tomorrow maybe well not tomorrow I'll be working tomorrow but um I guess I'll see y'all next time bye